Hello, my name is Jim Mullaney from SciTech Process Solutions. Today is Wednesday, August 4th, 2021. Uh, today I'm doing a video source inspection of two Vertec 1800-6 spinner wrench dryers. This video will be loaded up to our YouTube channel so we don't give our uh, customer's name. However, their PO number is 7249-21. Uh, these are going over to Asia. Uh, these systems are set up with the low profile Integris A19281M uh, cassette and um, uh, they've been fully refurbished. What I'll go ahead and do is uh, I'll go ahead and start the systems and then I'll talk about uh, Cytex uh, rebuild manufacturing capability and support capability because uh, it's kind of boring for watching these run um, after we start. So I'll go ahead and to load the cassettes. I got to do the hit the kick panel down below. You simply load. You'll notice that the vertex are much louder than other wrench dryers because they have a high uh, high end two. There we go. And we simply hit start. I'll do the same over here. And Simply hit start. There we go. Alrighty. We're doing a short 30 second rinse. Uh, so, and then we're going to move into uh, the way the vertex work is step zero is actually the first step. Uh, some people get a little confused, so it seems like zero is not a step. Then step one is actually the second step. Now we have the second step and we're going into the dry. Uh, we have 330 seconds on there, which will be uh, five and a half minutes and we're running approximately 1200 RPM. This, this unit has five seconds left. We'll go into the dry. And there we go. All right. So uh, the, this customer has actually purchased four systems, two have already been delivered. These two systems actually were ready probably two or three weeks ago. Um, but we were, uh, we had other systems uh, that had to come into test and once we pull systems out of test, we have too many rinser dryers in line that we've given commitments to the other customers uh, um, to uh, then take them out and put them back in. So we finally had a gap today uh, and yesterday to uh, reset them back up and get them uh, all retested again uh, because once we roll them out and they've been out of the final test for a couple weeks, we like to retest everything. So they're running well now. Uh, so at SciTech, we are the number one U.S. Uh, and worldwide supplier of refurbished uh, uh, spinner wrench dryers. Uh, two years ago, we purchased uh, the Vertec product line from MarTech. We are now the owners of the OEM of uh, the Vertec product line, the spare parts, the drawings, uh, the software, everything uh, 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 that goes along with that. Uh, we also are the world leader in the, the remanufacture of semi tool spinner wrench dryers. Uh, we do all versions. If you go to our um, website, at SciTechProcess.com, you'll see on the left-hand side, the first uh, uh, seven, uh, now eight buttons, are all SRD related. The first three are the semi-tool S models in SAM, S is in Frank, and ST, the traditional one. We can build any size, any type, any configuration of those. The next three are all the spare parts. We have 100% spare parts on all those versions. Uh, the, the next button down is our support on the semi-tool SST and WST line. We actually have, uh, I think, three SSTs in stock now and we have a variety of spare parts uh, there. And then we have the Vertec product line. Uh, now we own Vertec again, so uh, we're still really ramping up uh, uh, on the manufacturing of this. Uh, we still have quite a lot of inventory we're cataloging, and uh, we just started uh, in this probably last year doing remanufacturing of the tools, and now we have quite a lot of customers always send us their Vertex to be refurbished. Um, so uh, we have about three minutes to go still. Uh, at the end of the process, what I'll do is when the system's upright to home position 12 o'clock, I'll then open the door. It'll be loud again because that uh, N2 purge is loud. It's uh, unlike other rinse dryers, the spec is up to it's 90 PSI on the wall for the vertex. That's why it's so loud on the PSI purging. But there's regulators in the back where you turn it down. All right. Um, besides our uh, spin wrench dryer technology, we also are the leader in HTC remanufacturing. We do the 8020, 8030, 8010, and so forth. Uh, those are all the cassette and box washers. That's the Integris uh, floor roll line. Uh, we have uh, um, a, a lot of spare parts for those. We, uh, if you go to our website under the uh, box washers, you'll see spray nozzles, hubs, controllers, heaters, 
um, anything and everything. We, uh, we do all kinds of custom racks. Uh, we have standard racks for wafers. We do custom for uh, any kind of part the customer wants to clean. Uh, we also do quite a lot of the, uh, the mask cleaners, the high pressure uh, scrubbers. Those will be mask and wafer cleaners. That's the Ultra T, Ultra Tech, K and S and so forth. You'll see quite a lot of videos on our website of those too. And we got about two minutes to go still. We're drying very nicely. I can see the bowl is already dry. This is just to kind of baking everything out a little bit. Uh, besides our wet processing uh, technology uh, work we do, we also do uh, uh, metrology. We, have, um, uh, we do KLA uh, particle counters. We do the nanometrics tools. We have Gertner lipsometry. Uh, we have nanometrics thin film tool systems, um, deck tack systems, and so forth. So uh, we have uh, a lot of different uh, profiling uh, uh, equipment. Well, we do uh, a decent amount of photoresist pumps. Uh, well, a lot of customers send us their IDI 400, 450, 600, 610, 650. Uh, we have the cyborg pumps. We do the millipore pump packages. We do pumps, controllers, trigger switches. So we can supply complete pump packages and or we can supply uh, um, just the rebuild for customers' uh, direct pumps. Uh, we also have some SVG tracks in stock. Um, we, uh, we're the uh, number one manufacturer of MTI, but we've pretty much discontinued that product line uh, over the years uh, now and uh, really uh, don't support the MTIs like we used to. All right, we have about a minute left to go. Uh, we also do some uh, um, microscopes, high, pro high power, your Nikon lights, Olympus, etc. You'll see uh, on our website quite a lot of microscopes. So if you go to, again, SciTechProcess.com, your left-hand side, the top search uh, uh, a box, you can put in uh, a, a part number, a manufacturer, and you'll get different hits on our uh, site with specifications, pictures, and so forth. <coughs> What I didn't tell you is on the back of our systems here, we have our ID label. This is the Vertec uh, spinner dryer, manufactured Vertec 1800-6. This is ASRD number was 01364. That one is 0163. Date of remanufacture, July 2021. Made in the US and it has uh, this uh, information. Okay, we're almost done, here we go. <laughs> System number one is almost finished. It's now going to upright. There we go. Okay. This system has, uh, actually, it's spinning down right now. I'm gonna go ahead and open this one. Again, it gets loud. Feel for the hot, that's, that's high pressure right there. This is nice and warm. Very warm, actually, feels good. Uh, okay, nice and dry, beautiful. Let me uh, put these back in. Let's close the door. Alrighty, I'm going to go over here. Same thing. That's nice and warm. So it's just nice and dry. Looks good. Okay. So that will conclude uh, this brief. A video source inspection of two uh, refurbished uh, Vertec 1800-6 spin rinse dryers. Again, my name is Jim Mullaney from SciTech Process Solutions. If you'd like to contact us regarding any of our SRDs, our parts, our retrology, our wet processing equipment, there's uh, multiple ways. The easiest way is if you're on our website, uh, every product page has a contact sales button. You click on that, put in some information, they'll send us an email, we'll quickly get back to you. You can also call our main number at 916-797-9000. And then you can ask for anyone in our sales organization and they'll be more than happy to uh, work with you. Uh, by, uh, by the way, uh, we are very uh, uh, aware of the, the COVID-19 uh, issues here. At SciTech, everyone still wears masks. I only took mine off in final test uh, for this quick video uh, just because uh, I'm here by myself and you wouldn't be able to hear my video that well otherwise. But we do take all the safety precautions. Okay, that'll be it. Thank you. Have a great day.